I did at the farm. And my horse, I soaked her feet yesterday. I actually bought like this poultice pad. Jamie, Poppy! I love you too! Come on! Melanie's mowing my lawn up there. Come on! Oh, here they come. So I bought the poultice woolly pad. pad that has medicine on it and she was so fussy will you come down here come on they're coming slowly but surely they're just over there i'm screaming because there's no turkeys to scare off today come on babies come on oh here she comes now i haven't seen her literally trot since before the farrier came. She's walking nice, but she's not trotting. Anyways, as I was saying, I soaked it. I made a boot, soaked her hoof in this. Took the boot off later last night. Come on! And comes to turn out, I had it upside down. So the plastic was near her hoof instead of the medicated woolly part. So I ended up soaking it for like 20 minutes in Epsom salt boot. Oosh, there are turkeys up there. Oh, she was nervous. She's not feeling well still. She's still ouchy. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. Come here, mama. Yeah, she's still really ouchy. It's weird because I did her left back hoof. Hi! Well, you're coming down too, huh? Yeah, she got scared a couple times, but she didn't take off running, which look at how sore footed she, her back. So now it looks like her back right. So I poulticed her back left. She's kind of rope walking. You poor mare. Oh, poor baby. Poor girl. I love you, my sweet baby. All these mosquitoes on you. Yeah, poor mama. Poor mama. Yeah, they're all in there, aren't they? Yeah, shake them out. Oh, I love you too. I love you too. I don't get enough videos of me kissing her. Kisses. Me making out with my horse. Come here. You're so pretty. You're so pretty. It's so pretty. Come here, can we fix you? Huh? Yeah, so I came last night to cut the boot off. Which I was hoping she had an abscess and that it would get... Yeah, they're all just chewing you so much. Poor babies. Oh, you're getting better. You'll be fine. The, even the farrier said you're going to be fine soon. You're going to be fine soon and then we're going to be running and galloping and cantering and having all kinds of fun mama yeah this is the air she doesn't really like me touching oh i love you too sweet girl yes you're a lady you're a lady let's put this back on so i don't know if you can see the white stuff in the air it's like some weird plaques from the bugs so I try to keep the bonnet on at all times. I know. Oh my goodness. They just keep trying to get in there, don't they? They just keep trying to get in that ear. Come here, mama. I'm sure Melanie knows I'm here because my horses were watching her mow up there. Now they're down here. Hi, honey. So one of the things I've noticed about her being injured is as scared as she can be. She has not done her, like roll back 180 gallop off she's been you know if something frightens her she's been startling in place because it hurts her to go somewhere so let me get that bubba and get all your mosquitoes so the only thing is is like i have to put two and two together i have to go okay well after the farrier she was so sore she couldn't even hardly move so, 
he trimmed her too short. I soaked her hooves to heal the bruising or the pain or whatever. And uh, she did start to feel much better after that. Let me see your hoof mirror. You're a good girl. I love you so much. Look at the head. Do you see the head tossing? My old Jamie used to do that. That's an old Jamie. That's an old Jamie move. That's an old Jamie move. Yeah. Then he, when he does the slow motion bite, that's also an old Jamie move. She wasn't around old Jamie to be influenced by old Jamie. He was. He was. Okay, I mean, it's hot out today. This could be a, like a bath day. Yeah, it could be a bathy day. She's like, mm -hmm. she's pulling my coat off. No carrots for me, mommy? Girl, girl, don't put my coat in your mouth. Let me fix him. Come here, can I fix you? Can I fix you? Bert Trams, you have like bugs in your ears too, but baby. Come here, boy. Boy, he's already getting his his woolly coat for winter. And now it's like going to be almost 80 today. So, and no, I'm not going to give him a bath. He might need like a leg bath, like a poopy butt bath. Let's see what's got going on down there. He's all poopy again. You see that? He craps himself up. It's disgusting. I know. I'm so sorry, mommy. I'm so sorry, mommy. We love you. We love you. We love you, mama. We love you. You're so pretty. So yeah, she's had to fight her fears because she can't really take off and do much running because she's been hurting so much. I've never seen her like this before. It's like so upsetting. Mosquitoes. God, they're awful. Yeah, let me... My trunk is so full. I'm going to see if I can squeeze in there and get him some carrots, though, because he came all the way down here. I need to be rewarded. He needs a reward. I'm just going to put this in the car. Look at the head. The head is like, get away, get away. He's like, I don't hear you. I don't listen. I don't listen to the head. You can bob your head all day at me, sir. I don't listen. You don't tell me what to do. Right, Pops? Nobody tells you what to do, huh? Yeah, this is all the goodies I brought for hoof wrapping. I might try wrapping her back right foot today. Maybe such a pain in the butt. I don't have to do it. The farrier was like, just let her feet toughen up. I sometimes I wonder though, does she have an abscess brewing? You know, I don't know. That's the thing. Yeah, I'm coming in there, you. Watch your face. Poppy. She's like so close to the fence. Boy, I don't want to shock you. He's so suspicious. I did oh. I did a suit fitting on him the other day. The suit that I'm making him. Yeah, Mama Angel. Yeah, sweet girl. You're so sweet. My lady angel, yes you are. Oh God the heavens, please heal my mare. I love you so much, Mama. Good hi, Cher. I bite it in half myself and then give it to my favorite loved ones. Besides the dogs, of course, and my kid. Mm. Yes, I love you. I love you. So anyways, when I came back late last night. Um, I love you so much. We give you kisses. We give you kisses. Yeah. Yeah. I'll just give you kisses. I'd love to give you kisses. Hi, honey. Oh, you're so sweet. 
Oh, he just walks right. He doesn't care. He just walks right in front of her and cuts her right off. So if he got scared, I don't think she would run off. Because of how she's hurting so much. You hear that? That's something breaking. It's not to be scared of. You don't need to be afraid. If he takes off and she gets scared though, I don't know what's going to happen. Because she hurts. And I don't want her to hurt herself further. You're safe. Remember mommy broke sticks before? Remember when I did the stick breaking noise? Stick breaking noise is okay. You're safe. You're safe. You're safe, mama. You're safe, mama. She gives the best kisses. Don't give the best kisses, mares. <sighs> yeah, because it's so hot out, I could actually give them a nice little butt scrub, and I think I want to do that. I do it the easy way. I just take a bucket of, of water lately. I haven't been messing with the hose. It's just too um, annoying. You're safe. You're safe and you're fine and you're getting better. But yeah, she was so squiggly yesterday. So I have like a new way that I'm going to try to wrap her hoof. And I'll try the other one because yesterday I soaked... Yeah, you're so cute, Mama. Look at you. Look at you. Okay, Melanie's mowing your lawn. I'm gonna over and out it now. I don't think I'm gonna show me trying to wrap her. She's so squiggly. Very difficult. Very difficult to wrap her hooves. Like the other horse. Oh, gosh, it's so hot out. Man, 75. Um, Nakoma, who I was having to wrap her hoof with duct tape and everything, um, her owners, before they went out of town, he did a lot of groundwork with her, so she would be really good. And I don't want to do groundwork on a sore-footed horse, so what I do is, to get her to hold still, I'm just going to...